doing a vertical video. Um, Sue and us are, uh, we're in our car. We are heading to Wilson. We're going to get the jab. We're going to get the cocktail. Um, the COVID shot. It's not me, shot. So, yeah, my, I might have uh, like an affinity for brains. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, yeah. gonna do it and uh, see what happens don't know which one they're gonna give us I brought the GoPro so I'll probably gonna just hang this around my neck till they tell me I can't video <laughs> then I'll tell them okay I'm not I keep videoing <laughs> anyway um, yeah I don't even know if I'll post this video it might not be all that interesting but uh, all right, we'll see you when we get there. Oh, I didn't take my temperature today. She's gonna take it for us. Hello. Good morning. Here for your vaccination? Yes, ma'am. Okay, I just need to get your temperature and then you can go in, okay? Sure. Any COVID symptoms? No, ma'am. Okay. Okay, you're good. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Okay. I think we need to talk. Oh. We just go right over here. We don't have to talk to her. Uh -uh. This is kind of like when you have to vote. So here you got to show an ID. That's funny. Yeah, yeah. That's funny right there, huh? It took me a minute. Maybe that's what they'll do. They'll have it to the... You get the COVID shot. You have to have a COVID shot in order to vote. We should get our ID out. Do you have to use the restroom? After we're done. Okay. Back together. We're together. Y'all together. Okay. We'll sit down and find you. Okay. Thank you. Hey, I'm a little bit late. You take some of the people's thoughts coming out. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. Sure, they're new needles. <laughs> <laughs> they had something online and you... I was showing that they jabbed the person and the, it was a use. Oh, really? In the beginning. Yeah. Oh, this early on. They, oh. they, they did shot somebody and then they were doing so many people they forgot uh -huh. to grab a new needle and oh, they stuck no. the thing in. Oh. Oops. Yeah, so we get down. Uh huh. Actually, it's a single dose, so once we're done yeah. with that, we throw it. Hey, you can see that gentleman right there? He'll yeah. give you another one until he's done. <laughs> and this is uh, Johnson and Johnson. You guys got quite the system here. Nobody's turned into zombies yet. No. Not yet. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Would you like me? I think it's I thought about it. I'd rather be the zombie than the one fighting them. Yeah. <laughs> well, you have to let us know. Let you know, okay. Keep it coming as well. How high up do you need? Um, but, yeah, that should be good. Okay. I don't have any cold shoulder tops. They're, they're, they're on TV uh, talking about what you need to wear. <laughs> Just realize that on the weekend. And there's a pregnant lady in here. And she's wearing a cold shoulder top. So yeah. glad that. I'm gonna let you drop your fingers so I don't accidentally stick them, okay? Alright. Sting a bit. Big ass needle right there. Thanks a lot, y'all. Damn. It's just 
Oh, see, she wouldn't give it to you till after you got the jab, right? <laughs> I heard no, they're gonna make it so you can't. I heard though, it doesn't really stop the transmission. It just makes it so you like don't get real sick. So we're still gonna have to be all careful yeah, and everything. You still gotta be careful. Yeah, you do. Mm -hmm. I was uh, sick for about three days with the fever, and then I was weak, muscle issues, you know, but. Wasn't all that bad. We went to the um We got in a van Charlotte some lady Motor Speedway and we did a tour. Uh, Somebody was sick. And I was here and John was here and she was behind me. She was making all sorts of disgusting noises behind my head, but it was going right towards his face. And a few days later, you know how men get man colds. <laughs> it was yeah. like that. But your heart. It was on steroids. Like he was really Sick and and it would come and go like the headache would be there. You were for three weeks. I didn't get to 104. Oh, it was scary. Yeah. And and then we started hearing about COVID and then we're like, I bet you had it. Oh, does this one? Right, right now. They said. Uh, they said though though it, it's good to let the fever go up. Don't don't let the don't just control it. Don't. Don't let it go too high, but you can see fever helps okay. kill it. Right on. Okay. You need me? No. I need my, uh, okay. I need you, yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. All right, hold on. Let her do that now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Okay. Mm -hmm. You lift your sleeve for me and just keep that shoulder nice and relaxed. Are you going to cry? So there is a 15 minute wait time. Okay. So if you turn to the left and go down the hallway, they'll show you where to wait. Okay. Thank you. You're very welcome. Do you want me to keep your card? Yeah, but it won't fit in my wallet. You can get up and leave. Um, if you go in there and find a seat, if you have any questions, just ask me. That freaking hurts, doesn't it? Oh, a TV that girl just passed out or something, right? The nurse or something just passed out.
right, so we're still alive. I don't I feel, I feel a little bit numb. But not, not, not anything bad. Okay. Well, we finished the vaccine. I'm turning it on here. I think we also need the vaccine. It's your fault. Alright, maybe I shouldn't get around like that. But no, we did the we did the shot. Everything's cool. Um, your arm is supposed to be sore. Mine's not sore at all. Is yours sore? Mine's sore. Yours is sore? Yeah. Uh, maybe for the first minute or so, mine was a little bit sore. I, move it. And I thought... I thought I felt a little bit, um, like I took a Valium or something. That was a weird taste in my mouth. Do you have a weird taste in your mouth? No, but if you have Valium, I'm like... <laughs> I have a weird... on my tongue. Like if you were to put a penny in your mouth. I don't put a penny in your mouth, but if you ever did it when you were a kid, being stupid like that sovereign silver or whatever you know it's got a little bit of a metallic taste i got a metallic taste in my in my mouth right now so we're gonna go um get some brains and eggs or something no, we're not. <laughs> maybe i could talk her in a chick-fil-a but uh yeah so we went through Veridin, V-I-D, Vident, Vident Health Plex, that's it right there. That was great. They were really well organized, they really had everything together, kept keeping everybody separate and uh, yeah, made it easy, I was kind of worried about that. But uh, yeah, alright, so that's it, it's a big nothing burger, I don't know how long it or it'll last for or anything, but if anything goes bad, I'll be sure to film it and post it and hopefully it'll go viral. <laughs> I think I gotta add to the video that today is Saturday, um, March 13th. So if I get any symptoms from this vaccine, they said it would be within two to 14 days. So we'll have to see, you know, what happens. But, uh, so far so good, I guess. Yes. <laughs> okay, so now Sue has the metallic taste in her mouth as well. Looks like you had a penny in there or something. It's not real strong. Just wave it to the ABC store. It's not real. And you can just get it a little it's bit. Exactly like a copper penny. Yeah, it's like a copper penny in there. Because I suck on this all the time. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I know. So, we'll see what you yeah. find. Does this mean that we're gonna like not be able to taste our Chick-fil-A now? Means I'm gonna open that gold slogger any minute. Oh, uh, booze. So anyway, did the Moderna shot. That's what this is all about. I mean, the J and J. Um, I'll keep you posted if like you know body parts start falling off, I start drooping or really? starting want to eat brains and stuff. Go. So Take all right, just later. an update on this. Uh, so we got the shot on Saturday. Today is uh, Monday. Um, yeah, we got muscle aches. We both got mu real tense in your neck. Um, to be honest with you, I think I had COVID back in February and, um, this was a lot like that. Oh, somebody's came in over here to visit my cat. Um, it was a lot like it. Uh, so a little bit of a cold, like feeling, uh, cramps. Um, felt like I had to go to the bathroom a lot, but you know, what was really weird was the next day it was like my breath. It was like, you, you know, like if you were to buy something like, um, a pool float, you know, you take it out of that plastic and it has that plasticky smell. And if you like blow it up, it's kind of nasty. It was like, that was in my system. It's like I drank freaking antifreeze or something. 
And I think it uses a glycol. What? What do you want? Oh, he wants to hear the story. So it has like a glycol in it. So I don't know. Maybe that was like burning off or something. Um, I didn't get any fever or anything. I felt kind of like crap though. I didn't really feel too good. I think if you get this shot, just plan on like taking a day off the day after the shot. You're not going to get real, like for me, I don't know, maybe we didn't get real, real sick or anything. It just didn't feel right. Um, and then today I felt a little bit foggy this morning, more so than normal before my coffee. Of course, after the coffee it wasn't so bad. I did talk to my doctor. I told him I got the shot. He likes the Johnson and Johnson one. He says, um, for the different variants and things like that. Uh, and it's a different technology. Uh, the, the other two were an MRNA, the Johnson and Johnson, they basically make, uh, like a virus and they stunt it somehow. I don't know. So it's not real bad. So it's similar to the COVID. It's like they gave me COVID, right? Um, so, you know, that's the thing with this virus. I'm not a doctor, but listen, this is the way I heard it from people who are doctors. Um, if you were to get it, it depends. Like if somebody like sneezes in your face and you get a full load, it overwhelms your system and you're going to get really sick. If it's just a light particle or something, you're going to get sick barely. You might not even notice that you build up some sort of immunity. So anyways, a lot to this stuff. I, I, you know, I, I just got the thing. So I, I don't have to deal with it later. Uh, hopefully I don't get cancer or anything like that. I, you know, I don't trust anything that they say, but I kind of, I just, I just kind of want to be done with it. I want to be able to go back to reality and, if I die, I die. You know what I mean? It's just uh, it's just the way it is. All right. So thanks for watching. Um, it was it's a nothing burger. It's just a no big deal. But I don't know what's gonna happen long term. Nobody knows long term. So you know you're kind of on your own here and what you want to do. So I got it. I've got people that depend on me, and um, you know. I, if you ask my advice, I, I'd say go ahead and get the vaccine. I got friends that are doctors and nurses, and they all say to get the vaccine. So I think if you can get the vaccine, get it. Oh, and one other thing, like let's say you're in this county and, you know, big long wait or whatever. You can look around at other counties, even out of state. It doesn't matter where you go to get this vaccine. You can go anywhere. So if one county's way behind and another county, that's what we did. We went to a different county. And we were able to get our shot and we're not, um, you know, the high risk. Uh, well, I am kind of because, well, we both are actually because of our hearts. But um, that wasn't even the criteria. We just got word that they had them and we were able to get right in there. So I guess a lot of people aren't in a rush to get this vaccine. So, no. Uh, all right. See you later. Thanks for watching. Hey, if you could give me a thumbs up and share this video, I would appreciate it. Um, and check out my other videos. I got some pretty good content. Definitely want to check out the one where we chase the sun down at Carolina Beach and some of my fun uh, car drives and things like that. All right. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.